Afternoon. Um, I, I was getting no work done, so I thought I'd may as well do a stream instead. <laughs> um, yeah, just fancied a bit of a break, bit of, bit of Destiny 2, which I'm playing again because the new season started and there's all exciting things going on. I didn't really play much of the last one or maybe the one before. I can't remember. Um, thanks to Sea of Thieves, I haven't really played much Destiny 2, but I've been quite enjoying getting back into it. Um, who's in the chat? Bit Toad. Hello, Radio Isaac. Hello. What can you do with a thousand channel points? I don't know. Matt put a load of things on there, didn't he? But I think they were basically just copied and pasted like standard ones for the most part um, that we haven't really... I mean, down that drink for however many points it is. Well, I've got a basically empty Pepsi Max here. So that's... You know... Um, sorry, 11,000. Blimey. Um, we should add... We should, we, should add, we should do something with those. It's one, of, <laughs> it's one of those things it's hard to set stuff up for because obviously we all have completely different streaming setups and stuff. So, hey, cheers for the sub. Bit of toad. Hello, Woodfella, by the way. Um, so, yeah, it's one of those where you can't really... Is that... Is my camera auto-changing its... No, it's not. It's the sun's come out. Sorry, I thought it, the camera was doing like an auto um, exposure thing. Um, but no, it's just the weather changes outside, apparently. Um, anyway, yeah, I'm going to play some Destiny because it's good, isn't it? It's um, still, as far as I can tell, still a bit of a miserable experience for newcomers. Um, I haven't really fixed that yet. You've got 76,000. What will James do for those? I mean, what's in the... What, what's close? Oh, so you can be VIP for the week. We'll follow you on a social media platform. Uh, you can steal VIP. I don't even know. What does a VIP even do? You can time out someone else. I mean, that would be quite funny, but... Also somewhat mean-spirited. Uh, <laughs> but, I mean, whatever. Right, what should we do? Um, I'm basically just cracking on through the new stuff they've added, the override mode. So we'll we'll do a bit of that. Um, but where am I up to? What do I need? So I've got... Basically, right, it's really boring. You have a splicer gauntlet. And you get... <laughs> you put... Oh, what do you even put into it? So you put ether, you kill enemies, you get ether, you put ether into the gauntlet to make key codes, which let, let you unlock chests in override mode. And then you, <laughs> um, and then what? I think I've missed a step. And then there's also a big, right, yeah, I, know, I remember now, I need to go to a big robot to pick up some bounties first which is in the helm um the helm is actually quite a good idea i think it was the last season they added this it's basically just a little area where it's got all the but because obviously they can't just keep adding stuff to the tower um oh, look at that load time that fucking load time the power of the series s mate unbelievable right so you see so it's got your post box it's got a thing for doing your umbral engrams there's a war table over there that was for the previous uh, season but you can still do that stuff um, I always say this when I stream Destiny it's really because I normally play it on the, the big tally but like playing it on a monitor right in front of me really freaks me out um, right so here's this servitor and you buy bounties from this guy. Except I can't. I've already completed all of them. Because I'm fucking amazing. Because this is technically still the same day as last night, isn't it? According to Destiny. Right, I'll just buy a load of random ones then. I'm sure it'll be fine. Alright, battle limit reached. So what have we got? We've got defeat Vex with precision shots. Fine, I'm cracking on with that. Anyway, defeat combatants with solar abilities. Uh, power weapons, solar weapons, stasis weapons or abilities. Defeat combatants with grenades without dying. Okay, fine. 
Um, what I'll probably do is just crack on with... Because at the moment I've got my stasis subclass equipped, so I'll, I'll crack on with that. Get the 15 kills with stasis abilities. Um, do I have any stasis weapons? Yes, I do. I absolutely do. Let's get one of them out. I'm just going to bring my power level down a bit. But whatever. It's a little freezy pistol. Um, but I'll take that, take off that bounty in no time at all. And then, yeah, power weapons, fine. Solar weapons. I don't think I've... Have I got... I forgot that does solar damage. That grenade launcher. And a shotgun. Do I just leave that for another run? I think I do. Um... That's my guy, by the way, isn't he cool? Thanks to the new armor transmog system um, that apparently everyone hates because once you burn through the initial allotment of um, resources it gives you, apparently it takes basically about 25 hours of game time for you to get the resources to do like another full set, which is pretty, pretty bad. Um, uh, hang on, I think there's anything I can... So that's one, two, five, six, one, two, six, two, one, six, seven. So my best gun is one, two, six, nine. Six, four, six, seven. I'm never going to use that sniper rifle. I'm going to infuse that into this. Yeah. Marginally better. It gets me back up to... Um, one two seven two. Yeah, the thing is, because it, it's not even just that. Like, oh well, that's just how long it takes. Because you know, like if you play really well or, or whatever, it's that it's arbitrarily like it's on a timer. Shocker, scorched earth, more grenades, barrier and overload champions. Fine. Um, yeah, so it, it's literally enforced that you can only. I forget. I can't remember what the name of the resources are, but you get basically you get one every two minutes. And there's no way to increase that. Like, you can kill 100 enemies in two minutes. You'll get one of the items at the start and then one of the items at the end of the two minutes. Um, and then... But yeah, or you, could, you could kill one enemy, sit on your ass for two minutes, then kill another one, and you would get one of the items each time. Pretty weird. Uh, but obviously, you can pay real money, can't you? To just skip all of that. So that's... I mean, it is only a cosmetic thing, so... Still kind of shit. Um, but then they've also <laughs> changed it so that... It used to be when a new expansion or a new season came out, there'd be an option if you had any, like, uh, characters who weren't a high enough level. There was a little button you could click. I think you could, only, you could only do it, like, once per account. But there was a button you could click, and it would go, right, we'll bring that character up to the required power level. Fine. Nice gesture. Uh, yeah, that costs money now. <laughs> um, I can't remember much. I think it's like a tenner. But, um, yeah. Fucking weird. Um, oh, hey, Busk Lily. All right, mate. Um, I don't know. The transmog stuff, I don't really mind it. Um, just because... I don't know. Just because I quite I like dressing up my characters... And don't like having to make any sacrifices to make them look cool. Um, <laughs> like, I always really liked um, DC Universe Online, if you remember that. Actually quite good sort of action MMO. Um, it's probably aged really badly now, but it seemed cool on the PS3 at the time. And um, yeah, that just, every, every bit of armor you found, you also unlocked its appearance as well. Um... And that was that. So everything you, you found, um, you know, like as you were playing the game, if you found, if you then got something else that was better, but you didn't like the way it looked, well, fine, keep the appearance of your old one, doesn't matter. Um, it's just cosmetic is a poor excuse because games are all just cosmetics on a screen. Don't remind us of that when we're trying to have a nice time playing games. <laughs> Don't need to be told that it's all nonsense. No, I know, but you, you understand the distinction, though. Like, there's a difference between things that just affect you cosmetically and things that actually affect how the game plays, right? Um, right, here we go. Here we go. 
time for a bit of flipping override. The Vex network is a sprawling digital meta consciousness. Right, Osiris. And like a human mind, it can be manipulated. It's a weird sort of creepy thing to say, Osiris. Basically, right? Baddies appear, we shoot them, they drop purple things. I don't know what they are, Um I'm going to be really rubbish at this because I'm honestly it's weird how much difference it makes being this close to the screen I know I keep banging on about it and it's not fun um, but here we are Gun's special thing is that once it's killed an enemy, you can, um, it's got a special firing mode where basically you can use an entire clip and it will reload into the target. And it's incredibly useful. Said I am going to unequip this as soon as I've hit that target because I just remember I really don't like the feel of it. Basically, you gather the purple counter. things, you bank them in this thing here, and then once you reach, reach a certain threshold, things kick off a bit more. Oh my goodness! I just picked up an exotic! That's... I remember the last time that happened. Oh, fuck. That was strange. Right, there we go, that's that bounty complete. So let's sack this pistol off. Immediately. Yeah, so much of this game has changed now, it's ridiculous. And it's one of those where, like, obviously good fans, not so much for newcomers. So yeah, it reaches a threshold, it sends some bad bastards for you to kill, you kill them, and then there's this little sequence where... Oh, shit. Um, Spawns those little boxes, you shoot the red ones. Once you've shot the red ones, you spawn below the platforms. And then. Um, you have to jump up the platforms and then. Oh, that's right. Sorry, I'm a bit distracted. Full of moats. I am full of moats. More moats, please. So the other thing you do is occasionally this portal opens up and you can invade the Vex network and you kill like a mid boss and then pull out the data spike and basically just counts the shit like the boats. That's quite useful. Thank you.
So every time this happens, you have to get a bit further up. And I think it's the third time this big, this whole thing like opens up a big hole in the floor. I did not know that was a thing until yesterday when it just gave me a new one and I was absolutely overjoyed. Quickfang like the only um, lightweight sword in the game. But were there, were there others initially? I can't remember. I just remember thinking they were way cooler than any of the other swords, and then just seemed, and then they just sort of got rid of it. I didn't get rid. You, know, you could still unlock it, but no, oh, weird. Punching dogs feels good. I always feel bad for those guys. Genetically engineered angry dogs. Here we go. The path to the Vexnet. Right, here we go. Into the vortex. Into the internet pipes. The data you recover here will be invaluable to the future war cult. But not even Lakshmi can foresee the consequences of such a... Lakshmi can go fuck herself, by the way. She's been such an arsehole in this uh, season. Although I think that might be a story thing. As in... There's, there's, I've seen stuff of people saying like she's being manipulated. I'm going to activate my special platforms. Oh, fuck. What the fuck? What the fuck? <laughs> what? <laughs> what just happened? Wow. Never mind. Um, okay, it's going to teleport me anyway. Fine. So we one of my slicer upgrades is the ability to generate <laughs> this platform. <laughs> it does not fucking work. I can only assume I passed through it as they were still spawning or something. <laughs> Whatever. Um, oh, it's amazing on PC, man. It'd be so much better than the PS4 version. Jesus Christ. Like, you'll have to jump to 60 frames for one thing. Hey, he's new. Is he new? I have never spotted a network anomaly hanging around in here before. That I'm aware of. Get out of the way. Oh, my. Ooh, what's this? Always oh, dropped a load of goodies. Poor guy. I assume this goes in here. I've never actually grabbed one of these before. Yes, it does. Oh, he's just a random chance mini boss. Cool. 
Where's the guy shooting? I'm gonna do this and then he's gonna move. He always does. Oh no, no. <laughs> oh, hey, Lindy, you're right. It's proper good. Honestly, this new season's wicked. Um, it is fairly hostile to newcomers. But if you're already, like, if you don't base it, you think you'd be fine. Obviously, there's a bit of an adjustment period. He has three phases, each time he goes into this little tower, kill a bunch of guys, and he comes out again, basically. Never get tired of that. Everything they've built across time. Right. I want to end Osiris. Eradication of the Vex entirely. And humanity wonders why the Vex are so hostile. Do you not wonder if this is a future the Vex predict? We do what we must to survive. So will they. I hope this this talk of like maybe the Guardians being shitty is actually going somewhere <laughs> um because i feel like it isn't oh john blaze has departed sounds like a cool guy should have made friends um sixty nine kills it's good in tech Uh, Lindy, are you not are you not Xbox people? Because it's all free on Game Pass. Well, apart from the season passes, but that's like a tanner. Um, so worth it, I would say. Um, the light level requirement for the new season. Uh, trying to think. I mean, so that activity is. Recommends 1300, but then I'm not there. I'm only a measly 1272. I think this season I started, I was about 1240 ish. Um, so you climb pretty quickly. It's all right. Um, what did we go? Oh, yeah, I got Kepri Sting. That was weird. I can't remember what it does. It's the, yeah, it's the one with the big scarab beetle on it. Ugh. Ugh. Oh, so the cap only went up by 10. Right, so most people are probably already at a level where they can do most of this stuff. Interesting. Right, punching someone with full melee energy will instantly cast Smoke Bomb. Gain True Sight while in your own Smoke Bomb effect. Your Smoke Bombs deal increased damage. That sounds quite good. Sending me the bill? Whatever. Fucking... It's an investment in your own future, Lindy. Don't... <laughs> 
<laughs> have a go at me. Uh, one, two, six, seven, one, two, six, seven. Let's delete those. Um, oh, so Vault Glass is going to be 1300. Okay, makes sense. Um, it's sort of, it's kind of sad that I'm excited for Vault of Glass coming back. I don't even know if I'm going to do it. I can't imagine I'll have the time. But isn't it sort of rubbish that everyone's like, yeah, they're bringing back the first one they ever did. Like, isn't that sort of a, a somewhat sad admission of defeat? Do you know what I mean? <laughs> um, you don't think it's aged well? Okay. Do you think, well, they, surely they'll have rejigged stuff, right? Like, um, so I did uh, Sepix Prime for the first time in years yesterday. Um, and yeah, it's quite like a few, but quite significant changes to it. Um, right, so hang on. So we've picked up another Shattered Scythe here. It's got two more. Of course, yeah, I'll have champions, won't it? That makes sense. Uh, da, 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 da. So Rampage, that's very good. Field prep, increased damage reserves, faster reload stone. Really. You're crouching? I mean, I'm never crouching, so that's sort of useless. But then the other one had slideways, which is equally useless to me. So yeah, I'm gonna I'm gonna delete the lower one. Um, right. Am I just going to do the same thing again? No, let's go and cash in. Let's see what I get from the uh, that Engram that I picked up. Hey, Roger, you're right. Yeah, well, I've, I'm trying to sort of fold lunchtime streams back into being like a meaningful part of my day because I've st like I stopped doing them because I'm just like, oh, no, I've got too much work to do. But I'm not actually, excuse me, excuse me, uh, not actually getting any more done. It's just more time spent going, ah, fuck, I'm not doing any work. <laughs> Do you know what I mean? Um, so. Yeah, so I'm just trying, trying to get back into the habit. Uh, right. So basically, when you get an umbra the Umbral Engram, which is basically a, a magic box with an item in it, you can either just decode it as it is. And, oh, I've got two. Fuck. We had one, uh, so they'll be worth one, two, six, six power. However, you can also focus them to sort of specify a type of item that you would like, but that reduces the power a little bit. Um, so I don't know. I've kind of got everything I would want, to be honest. So what are these? All right, Engram containing swords. That's quite cool. So I just need to get a shitload more sword kills. And then... Da -da, Engram, chain, uh, Engram containing legendary weapons that can be found around the system. Um, do the free focuses until your servitor is fully upgraded. Ah, okay, cool. Upgrade the gauntlet. Oh, does it cost data to do those? Did I miss that? Oh my god, it does. Yeah, fuck that. Jesus. Writing your own job description. That's a hell of a position to be in. <laughs> uh, I only had 100 and something, didn't I? So I don't think I can unlock anything else yet. How are we looking, mate? Yeah, so I need to start saving for these big ones. Uh, do, 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 um, increase the youth capacity, I'm going to replenish, da, da, da. so there's nothing that increases, yeah, so you can only increase the chance to drop ether, not the chance to drop decrypted data, is that right? Um, yeah, second row, okay, cool, we'll do, um, is it worth buying the Beyond Light expansion? Um, yeah, I mean, I'm pretty sure you need that to then do any of the season stuff. Um, people in the chat might be able to correct me on that one. Um, I, I promise I will stop saying this soon, but if you have Game Pass, it's on there, <laughs> on the Xbox. I don't, it's not on Game Pass for PC yet, is it still? Um, 
Second row gives you more data per run. All right, okay, cool. Um, right, more override then. Hang on, I've still got loads of keys, haven't I? Oh, cash them in. Should have got some more bounties. Should have got some more bounties. Never mind. Uh, what am I doing? Yes, yeah, so we've still got two key codes. That's fine. And then I'm only a few ether off getting another key code. Uh, right, bounties, bounties. Yeah, it's supposed to be um, coming this year, but I don't know. Surprise me, I'm allowed to go two. Does anyone know what the deal is with only being able to hold like a few bounties of each? Has that always been the case? It has, hasn't it? Just felt like it was new, and it's been annoying. <laughs> Uh, that's right, solar abilities, power weapons, energy weapons, solar weapons. Alright, let's go, let's go full bloody solar then. What have we got? What have we got? I grenade, hate grenade launchers, probably go with the shotty. And then these are all... Oh, he's useless! Useless! 266, Let's be a nice guardian again. This is going to feel weird. Um, is that a thing, Matt? The crossplay thing? Because I did not know that. Bloody hell! They did a they did a Rocket League. <laughs> Oh, it was crashing the game. So it actually didn't work. Fair enough. Uh, okay, cool. Let's do some override again. I sure hope you all tuned in to see me do the same thing over and over again. I mean, you knew it was a Destiny 2 stream, so... <laughs> Okay, next season. Nice one. That'd be cool. I mean, off the top of my head, I don't know anyone... I guess the, the TCGS clan is still scattered, right? Um, I know a lot of you were PS4 and then PC. I don't think anyone's like... How many people have moved over to the Xbox? I thought there was going to be like a mass exodus, but uh, I think it was just me. <laughs> there is a comfort to familiarity and that's what this is all about at this point just want a sprinkling of, of sort of added complexity every three months um, yeah it's just it's nice hello pubis Like it's just been really nice just sticking it because I like I'm very bad at listening to podcasts because um, I can't have them on while I'm working because I get confused. Um, so it's basically when I'm driving or doing jobs around the house um, or when I'm playing Destiny 2 or Hard Space Shipbreaker or something that I don't need to have to listen to the words. Um, this game is Destiny 2. Within the Vex network lies the secret to their poor soul technology. That voice. We could do great things with such power. James is a baddie. It's something new, that's right. <laughs> Never mentioned this game before. I'm throwing knives at yes. I need to use some shotgun. Get them solar filled in. Well, this is it, Roger, yeah. Like, used to do quite a bit driving for work and stuff. Not so much in the last year. Destroyed Vex, you the right source of data. We get into the terminal to crash the system. Oh, good. Managed to throw the knives people to whom they would do no damage whatsoever. 
very good at this. I always forget how bad range on shotguns in in this game. Basically, melee weapons. They don't even say what type of moats they are now. It's like, yeah, just some moats. I don't know. Data. Some kind, probably. Weird, like you'll get three or four people trying to jump to the top, which is partly people just going, No, me, 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 I want to do it, me. But also, it's quite useful because sometimes people fall. <laughs> it's like a, every person a little insurance policy. Oh, 
sorry. Very hard to keep an eye on the chat while playing this. I keep like glancing and it's like people talking about the Inspector Gadget theme or something, I don't know. And then, <laughs> but I'm just wanting to have my nice time. Why are they so tough? Savannah, thank you very much. I do enjoy a bit of Ted Cross. I should play more of it. I've got two of the ones they released on the Switch. It's a race. Oh, there we go. <laughs> me, I want to do it. Me, 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 me. <laughs> the path to the back is yeah, I, I found it really bad because I, I love the idea of murder by, num uh, yeah, murder by numbers. Um, there's a bit too much story in it for me. Which is, I mean, that's just me. Um, like, it's not a, an actual criticism. I can't just want it to. Oh, ah, well, well. oh no! Ooh, oh. <laughs> yeah, I just wanted to do a load of puzzles with like a very, like a very quick sort of loose uh, narrative through line. Um, There's actually quite a lot of story. No. I'm just saying that's not like that. Yeah, crush the machine so we can leave and then come back again and do it again because we want to stop. Why not? So I'm going to be a bad teammate and just check. How have I not done the solo weapons one yet? Fucking shotgun, man. They're a liability.
focus deletion. She must just kill X number of assholes. Which is I couldn't agree more. more back and doing this again. As much as I want to be able to stop and savor this moment, the Vex won't afford us that time. That is uncommon focus. In your experience with humanity? Many humans and their kin are eager to <laughs> shed the weight of their responsibility. <laughs> now they got it left. Some of us bear that weight longer than yeah. others, if we're strong enough. She just killed her in 12 seconds. Amazing. <clears throat> well, that was a success, apart from... Only 69 kills. Uh, sorry, 65. It was 69 last time. Um, I should have gone with the grenade launcher. Let's equip that this time. Absolutely fine, I'm sure. Uh, oh, what did I get? Uh, Beringer's memory. Fuck off. First try. Jesus. I keep forgetting these. I need to tick these triumph things off. Because they do actually affect other unlocks and stuff now, don't they? Or maybe they always did, I don't know. Right, uh, am I just doing that again? I think I am. He is an animal, ferocious beast. Our Aaron. Right, gonna do that again. I think. <laughs> so I don't think I've got enough uh, decrypted data to do anything useful with. Oh, something's in the post box. But... Can't be asked. Oh, hello, Skunkle Bert. Thank you for gifting a sub, mate. That's incredibly kind. Uh, did, I, did, I, did I get that? It wasn't a good helmet. It's just a boring ass, normal ass helmet. Now, should I? Because at the moment, my exotic, I'm using Mechaneer's trick sleeves, which is really cool when you've got a sidearm. Um. But also, Assassin's Cowl is incredibly useful, so I might swap that in, that in there, and then infuse this with that blue that I've picked up. You change the shader on it. Don't want to look like an idiot. Wait, is that the right? It's close enough. I am having a good one, thank you, yes. Just smashing the um, override mode. 
because it's very good fun. Hang on, so what have I got? Sorry, yeah, what have I got in terms of bounties still? Oh yeah, I ticked one off, didn't I? So then I've got... Do I not kill anyone with power weapons? Right, well we can fix that. So I have a bit of sword time. Bit of bit of grenade launcher time. Oh yeah, we need to, need to lob some more grenades as well. And then solar abilities. Alright, alright. Grenades, grenade launchers, swords. So basically don't use the pistol, that's the... <laughs> That's the move. Um, which is a shame, because I really like using the pistol, and that's probably why I didn't tick any of those off last time. I'm very happy um, that the uh, Disco Elysium episode of Kane and Rince is out. Very pleased about that. Um... Only if you're a patron supporter, which I am. <laughs> Who's on it? It's, uh, I believe, so it's Ryan. I don't know why I'm looking at my phone. Literally, just not even, I haven't even got the text up. I'm like, you know, when people say, oh, what time is it? And you sort of look at your wrist, even though you're not wearing a watch. Uh, so it's Ryan Heyman, uh, Josh Garrity, uh, John. Oh my God, John, what's your surname? I can't remember what John's surname is. And Leah. Um... Yeah, so it's good, good team. <clears throat> I um, so after I recorded the Trinity episode the other week, and um, obviously Leon ended it by saying, "Oh, next week it's Disco Elysium," and so then we finished the recording. And I was like, "Oh, who's on it?" Um, and he sort of said, and like, bless him, he said, he said, "Oh no, you you were on the the short list, but obviously there's a lot of people want to be on it." I said, "No, no, I wasn't." I wasn't angling, I was just, <laughs> just excited um, to, to hear who's on it. Um... Oh, cheers, Muscalilly. I'm not going to use your real name, because I never know if that's appropriate or not. Even though every time I say this, the person in question goes, yeah, of course, of course you can. What's the, <laughs> what's the problem? Oh, that's a nice spaceship that's being covered up by the chat box. Hang on a minute. Let me just... Oh, look at that. Looks like it's got all ice or rockets on it okay <laughs> big fan of that oh so now i've put the chat back on it has to go up from the bottom again doesn't it it's brilliant what a great system um well in that case luke thank you I've got six grenades in my grenade launcher. I hope I use them wisely. <laughs> oh, Mr. Owl 2099 has departed. How are we, we going to do this now? Mr. Owl. Ooh. Grenade launchers are very fun. I don't know why I don't use them more often. I'm sort of bad at them. And that's me wasted one sixth of my entire. Oh, fuck off! <laughs> there you go. Look at that. 
I've got a, got a thing in the bottom of the screen. Never. Oh. They did right. Can anyone confirm they they know when they're being aimed at, and that is when they teleport, or is it, does it just feel like that? Oh, dead. Job, Sean. I wonder if I managed to get there in time to do anything cool. I assume not. Oh, we all are we done. Okay. Sort of worth it. Oh god! We kicked out! the grenade launchers it's the way the grenade just so comically just bounces off I 
sends the Vex mind. It lashes out with some. I feel like I'm getting less bad. They have grenade launcher. I feel like I haven't sworn as much to start using it. That was a bad night. Hey! Oh, five grenade kills without dying. I don't think I throw five grenades without dying. Never mind killing five enemies. And you? This is the last attempt to lock you out. The vortex is almost open. Come on, team. Come on, Daddy T54443. Be a mate. Quick shoot the red boxes. the best. I'm the best. I'm the top of the mountain. The splice is complete. Let's not linger here, Guardian. The interior of the Vex network can be disorienting. Stouter minds than ours have been driven to right, madness. Where am I on me? Uh, me bounties. Tick, tick, tick. Grenades. Solar abilities. Still need the solar abilities one. Fine. Oh, my season rank's gone up. <laughs> Fucking mint. Yeah, I still need to do the um, the dungeon, the one. Oh, oh. What? What just hurt me then? <laughs> yeah, the one they added that you access through the tower. Yeah, it was, uh, yeah, that's prophecy, isn't it? Yeah, I never did it. And the requirement's only like 1100 now, isn't it? Probably do that. Oh Christ! <clears throat> yeah, I heard really good things. I'd say, <laughs> I may have been accidentally put off it. I'm well, not put off it, but I saw Matt stroke Glacier Rays do a bit, but he was doing it solo and having a bad time. Oh no, I mean he was having a good time, but. It, I would, if I was in the same circumstances, I would be having a bad time, if that makes sense. Um, yeah. Um, so yeah, I feel like, oh man, this looks really tough, but obviously it looks really tough because... So what are the other two? I don't think I can even remember. There's the uh, the one in the oh my god, I've gone everything. The, the Dreaming City. <laughs> Shattered Throne. Yeah, that's cool. I did that a while back, but we were a little bit not under leveled, but not sufficiently over leveled to have like a easy time. <laughs> I guess he's not got a barrier weapon in place. Oh dear. Oh, Pit of Heresy on the moon, cool. Uh, 
get up. Saying I've not got any more solar ability kills. I've done loads. What am I forgetting? God, why am I using a grenade launcher on this tiny enemy? Right, got some throwing knives. Please present me with a load of weak enemies. Into which. Oh, hello. Hello. You. Not you. You're too big. Stop it. I'm going to end up killing the boss before. Please spawn lots of guys. Here we go. Oh, fucking fuck's sake! <laughs> I mean, if I could get a super, that would be. <sighs> super? While there's still enemies around? Please? Come on, here we go, here we go, here we go, here we go. How? How? How is that not? <laughs> what is going on? Unbelievable. Feel bad. In override, defeat combatants with solar abilities. I definitely fucking did that. <laughs> That's so strange. What that was about? Right. Um, let's do some admin. Best bit of any game. And then I'll call it a day and go back to work. Let's go to the helm. Decrypt. Some nonsense. Oh. It does this sometimes. It's like, where are we going? Then my ships. We've left my ship. <laughs> Oh yeah, I got Prime Engram, didn't I? Damn. Second, sorry. I can't believe the hunters have been thrusting themselves into the right. leadership. One, two, six, eight. Bad omens. Fuck off. I'll show you fucking bad omens, mate. Unbelievable. Oh, and I got a war mantis helmet. Fantastic. I assume. So I don't have enough data to unlock anything cool in the gauntlet. But let's have a look. Nah. I'm not too far off though. 
Tell us something. Alright, cool. Uh, let's go to the main tower, don't I? Go and see Master Rahul. Ooh, what's over here? What's flashing over here? Ada 1? I must have picked up enough bullshit strands. To, to, to mean something. <laughs> what else do we get? So, sniper rifle, go away. Do not like. Sniper rifles. Scout rifle. Um, oh, that's the kinetic. Grenade launcher. Kills this weapon, generate grenade energy. Activating your grenade energy, uh, grenade ability. Reloads this weapon from reserves. That's quite cool. Um, oh, increase handling, reload speed, and stability for each fully charged ability. Cool. Can I stay for a bit? Finish the job description halfway through my one to one form. Shit, man. I'm supposed to do mine. I haven't done mine. I had my annual appraisal about a month ago. Let's probably sort that out. Uh, right. Let's <clears throat> see this. what we've got. Hello, Guardian. Welcome. 1270. Eternal Blazon. That's the scout rifle, isn't it? Yeah. 1270, though. Pretty good. Don't, I mean, basically, but generally speaking, in this game, I have to use full auto weapons because it fucks up my fingers. <laughs> Otherwise... Um, so I'll probably just infuse that into. I must admit, oh, no, sorry, Guardian. One two seven. Very curious to see what you've got. Well then, to crack open. probably infuse it into Risk Runner then, because that is still my favourite exotic in the game. Um. Okay. Let's go see what Ada wanted, I guess. I know I could teleport, but I'm not gonna. This is the part where it turns out I don't actually remember how to get there. Yes. No. Fuck. Here we go. <laughs> yes, here we go. <laughs> I wonder if they'll do more with this area in general. I feel like they've created all these like nice little nooks and like stalls that they could open up. Like it's this obviously this sort of gorgeous like unused sort of Medina. Um, I hope it all sort of gets lit up properly one day. Like all the tiles and stuff in the ceilings. Who's hanging the washing up there? How are they getting to it? Who's who's reaching that? Whatever. I generally like those those little touches they do. To be fair. Hey, they're trying to use the Pepsi machine. I do like this. Just as a as a visual. I think it's very cool. Alright, what do you want, Ada? Welcome back. So nothing interesting then. This fucks me off. Ascendant shards. I need one. Um, if I want to unlock an exotic. Fucking ten enhancement prisms, each of which costs ten enhancement cores. A load of shite. Whatever. Uh, right. Oh, is this just because I can get one of these new bounties? It is, isn't it? So, uh, randomly selected Vanguard, Objective, Crucible, Gambit, Destination, or Raid slash Dungeon. It's got to be Vanguard. You can buy a bounty. Yeah, 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 you're right. You're right. And it costs 150 synth strand. It's yours. Hooray. Um, and then this doesn't actually do anything, does it? Oh, it does when you've got 100 sleek synth cord. That's a very slow scanner. 
scanning the same two pages over and over again. Weird. <laughs> right. I think that's it. I think that's everything now. Accumulate for nightfall. I'm too. I'm a tiny baby. I can't do nightfall. The founders of the Black Armory were visionaries, Shit. inventors. I need some more. If the armory is going to survive, I must be the same. My type. Uh, right. Cool. Let's leave it there then. Um. Is anyone, does anyone stream in? Is there anyone, I mean, there's only 12 of us. It's worth raiding. It's from the end of the Scourge of the Past raid. Oh, that's quite cool. That is quite cool. Plumbing through great schematics is like learning a new language. Um, do, 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 no, there's no one on that, I know. Right, fuck it. We'll just, we'll just go then. We'll just go. That's it. Um, thanks so much for tuning in. Um, we'll do more of these. Probably not more Destiny stuff unless there's... It, it looks like the, the like things are going to change a bit week by week, which is cool. Um, but yeah. Um, Why should I fear stasis? Yeah, I don't I've know what else to do next. I've seen used by warlords and guardians but alike. <laughs> and yeah, thanks a so much for tuning in. Obviously, we're recording the podcast tonight. We are doing a listener correspondence special so if you've got any questions visit tcgs.co forward slash dear tcgs um and you might get it read out we've got absolutely shit loads already and i feel like we've set up the expectation that we'll actually get loads of them read out but we might not but we'll see um but yeah thanks I for hanging out and i'll see you soon forges. one way or the other I, take I care i still haven't still got a proper end screen so you'll just see james farley's name in word art again so enjoy that cheers <laughs>